Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Assalamu Alaikum Dear learners you are welcome to online class this is Muhammad Ubaidullah speaking before you I am a junior instructor non tech department Bogra Polytechnic Institute Bogra Dear learners let's come back to our main topic and just a single word we can see on the screen the word is tense and uh, we have to know what is that what is the meaning of tense how many type of tense and how to make the structures and i think if you listen to my lecture today i think this lecture will help you to understand the topic before you starting your main discussion i would like to remind you about our previous class in the previous class i have discussed what is uh, articles and how to use articles how many types of articles and today i will discuss uses of tense that means a right form of verbs with indicator let's go to our dear students now i am going to explain the tense what is tense and if you want to understand the tense you have to look at the following words okay tense tense means time what is the meaning of time time means time of verb and uh, time of verb means time of working when does something happens when does something happens we call tense and every word ap word means every verb express the time of working and here if i if i talk in bangla here time ke amra shomoy boli shomoy othoba kal boli shoz bangla shomoy ebong আমরা টেন্সকে তিন ভাগে ভাগ করতে পারি গতকাল আজ আগামীকাল এই শব্দগুলিকে আমরা যদি ইংরেজিতে অনুবাদ করি তাহলে আমরা কি পাবো টাইম মিনস সময় ইস্টারডে গতকাল টুডে আজ টুমোরো আগামীকাল আমরা খুব সহজেই এখান থেকে বুঝতে পারছি যে সময় তিন প্রকার আজ আগামীকাল গতকাল ও ইংরেজিতে আমরা এগুলো বলছি ইয়ে স্টার্ট টুডে টুমোরো সো হোয়েন উই টক হোয়েন ইউ টক ইন গ্রামার ওই উইল কল দেন টেন্স আমরা তখন সময়কে টাইম না বলে আমরা টেন্স বলে থাকি একইভাবে পাস্ট টেন্স গতকালকে আমরা ইয়ে স্টার্টে বলছি এবং ইয়ে স্টার্টে আমরা টেন্সের ভাষায় পাস্ট টেন্স বলছি এখানে আজ মানে প্রেজেন্ট প্রেজেন্ট টেন্স ইংরেজিতে আমরা টুডে বলে থাকি এখানে ফিউচার টেন্স মানে আমরা টুমোরো বলবো বাংলা যদি আমরা বলি আগামীকাল সো বেসড অন দিস ডিসকাশন উই ক্যান সে টেন্স আর টেন্সেস আর থ্রি টাইপস প্রেজেন্ট সরি পাস্ট প্রেজেন্ট অ্যান্ড ফিউচার ওকে সো ইউ হ্যাভ টু রিমেম্বার দ্যাট ইফ ইউ উইক ইন টেন্স I will call you that you are weak in English. So, if you be strong in tense, that means you are strong in English. And tenses are nothing but some structure. Tense is a structure and you have to know the structure and these structures will help you to 
is speak and this structure will help you how to write and this structure will help you how to understand so without tense we cannot learn grammar without tense we cannot talk in english without tense we cannot correct english so english is very important in our academic life in this current slide i have explained the classification of tense and i have also sub divided this tense into four category total types will be 12 so look at the classification basically tenses are three types present past and future and i have sub divided into four category look at present indefinite it will be present continuous present perfect present perfect continuous this way it will be pre past indefinite past continuous past perfect past perfect continuous and finally future will be future indefinite future continuous future perfect future perfect continuous and here I have also explained the differences among these tenses and you have to understand the differences what are the differences among them look at after the end of verbs especially in Bangla sentence we will get symbol get letter so at the end of Bangla sentence look at exceptional he plays present indefinite it is exceptional but um, continuous tense there is so perfect tense so there is last at last so she kilitese so and the same way after the end of Bangla sentence with verb with here we will get law or so symbol later she carries hilo law she killed to okay these are simple we are getting after the end of Bangla sentence law or the he was playing law okay she khelia silo law she khelte silo there is also law these are the simple of law or the we get after the end of after the end of every sentence especially in the case of past tense look at future I have written here in bracket ball later he will play there is also boss she kill be he will be playing she kill the thug be he will have played she kill ya thug be there is boss he will have been playing there is also boss symbol at the end of bangla sentence she kill the thug be these are the symbol this is a letter symbol after the end of every cases we getting this in present tense so remember past tense lower the future tense bo and in the same way here in the case of indefinite tense indefinite means not definite indefinite ortho yoche kono nirdishto na fixed na that is why we are getting no symbol in the case of present indefinite tense okay there is no any symbol bangla symbol but when uh, we are if we are making the sentence continuous in the case of continuous tense in every cases we will get tesi okay look at she kheli tese she kheli tesi lo khel tesi lo she khel te thakbe te symbol okay every in every cases we are getting te symbol tesi or te okay tesi to su tese these are the symbol of continuous tense in the case of perfect tense have has okay we will get on the store or a a symbol and uh, in in uh, look at here he has played she kelly as a he had played she kelly a silo on the store or a a a symbol he will have played on the star or a car a these are the bengali symbol and in the case of perfect um, tense English symbol will will have here 
will get have and has look at has had and have okay these are the perfect symbol and uh, i have forgotten to tell you that in the case of continuous tense we'll get the english symbol b and ing okay look at b means b verb here is 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 b verb was b verb be here be far and after the end of every english sentence we are getting ing form because this is continuous tense look at playing ing form play with ing play plus ing he will be playing okay these are the ing form after the end of continuous tense and in the same case we can see uh, perfect continuous tense and i have already told you that perfect symbol have or has and verb number three that means past participle look at perfect symbol here has and past participle here been and continuous symbol be verb and ing form there is also be verb and ing form okay so in the same way we are getting this symbol okay he has been playing bengali he he had been playing she killed this you know he will have been playing she killed it had been and already i have also explained that after the end of uh, future tense after the after when we get the future tense without will without shall or will bar we cannot make future tense that is why in every sentences of future tense we'll get will shall or will or we will get in the case of Bangla sentence ball later okay so these are the classification these are the difference among these sentence structures so we have to uh, we have to memorize them and uh, and these differences will help you to understand the sentences okay understand the tenses and uh, in the next slide we will explain it clearly again okay and so look at same in this slide i want to talk a little bit more again look at same table here present past and future and future and continuous present continuous past continuous future continuous Okay, especially I am here. I am going to Alada kure explain korte chai. Cheta hote continuous tense. Jekne thakbe shekhane amar tesi kotha ta amra pye jabo shekhili tese shekhili tese lo shekhili the thakbe. Kintu ekhane amra arik tu ege jai perfect tense, perfect continuous tense. Bhalo kure shal koro follow me and be careful. Present continuous shekhili tese lo he is playing. Bengali sentence, Bangla sentence, she khili tese, she khili tese. These are two type of sentences are same. Okay, she khili tese, she khili tese. But the English structure are different in these two cases. Okay, he is playing, he has been playing. So the English structure do ito amra alada dikte paachi, kintu Bangla shob shomey amra yaki unu baad dikte paachi. In the same way, she khili tese lo, she khili tese lo. Bangla same. Bangla meaning same but English structure are different. Okay, he will be playing. She killed the third way. He will have been playing. A kind of umbra Bangla meaning a key dicta patchy into English structure gulu. Another baby dicta. The whole umbra cocoon. Kun kitramra present continuous. Bever curve. Kun kitramra perfect continuous. Bever curve. So this we have to remember. Okay, so. Jokhon when will get a time expression in the case of getting time expression we will use the later form past present perfect continuous Jokhon amra sentence shonge shamoy ba time expression pabo tokhon amra porer structure that means advanced tense amra perfect continuous structure ta byabohar kore thaki in the same way, I can have a time expression pabo, tokonamra perfect continuous tense before Kurbu, Jokon Kirokum, the Kamri example. For example, he has been playing for three hours. She shockal, he has been playing for three hours. Check in Honda Dure, 
खेलते से ओके सो दिस आर टाइम एक्सप्रेशन बट इन द केस ऑफ प्रेजेंट कंटीन्यूअस टेंस वी विल नॉट गेट एनी टाइम एक्सप्रेशन इन द सेम वे ही हैड बीन प्लेइंग ही हैड बीन प्लेइंग ही हैड बीन प्लेइंग फॉर थ्री लास्ट थ्री इयर्स सो हियर आल्सो वी आर गेटिंग टाइम एक्सप्रेशन से तीन घंटा धरे खेलती थी एंड ही हैड बीन प्लेइंग फॉर थ्री इयर्स से तीन घंटा धरे खेलते थको सो दिस आर टाइम एक्सप्रेशन and uh, another example he has been playing since morning or from morning mar kisi ki khetre since othoba from byabohar kore thaki these are also time expression but in the continuous in the case of present continuous tense there will no there will get no time expression in the same way past continuous tense will get no time expression but um, will get perfect in the case of perfect continuous tense we we'll get time expression these are the difference okay in the same way and uh, look at the difference between past indefinite and past perfect in the case of past indefinite um this is very uh, basic or simple simple past we sometimes call simple past and that uh, that is in bangla we call near otit past indefinite ke amra near otit bole thaki ebong perfect past perfect पास्ट परफेक्ट के दूर अतीत बोले थकब सपोज जे का खूब निकटे पास हो गए पास इंडिफिनेट लिखब और जो हमारे दुईटे क्ज सपोज टू एक्शन हाफेन वन हाफेन अदार जो दुईटा क्ज एक एक आगे एक घटे ए रकम क्षेत्र इन दिस केसेस उल रईट पास परफेक्ट कन्टिन्यूस टेंस एंड अन्य वन पास इंडिफिनेट टेंस ओके तेरा मन रखते हैं In the same way, future tense are past perfect and future future perfect, future continuous, future uh, past continuous are same. Okay, these are the basic difference among these sentence structures. So you have to remember this. And in the next sentence, uh, next slide will show. Uh, I will try to show, or I will try to explain this chart again in different way. Look at. Here I have uh, changed a little bit in this table. Okay, look at present, past, future, present, indefinite, present, continuous, present, perfect, present, perfect, continuous. These are the twelve type of structures, twelve type of tenses, and I would I would like to say to you that uh, in the case of Bangla, uh, Bangla, I am just going to say, first five prakar. the first six type of sentence present indefinite and present continuous past indefinite past continuous future indefinite future continuous these are the basic sentence basic tense structure these are basic structure and next six next six tenses are advanced sentence structure advanced tense so amra tense shekhar khetre amra prothome बेसिक टेंस शिखे नहीं बेसिक टेंस शिखते पर टेंसा अनेक सहज हो जाए सो उ हाव टू लार्न द फार्ष्ट सिक्स टाइप अफ सेंटेंसेस एंड दैन उव टू गो दस टेंसेस ओके एंड अलरेडी हाव डिसक दस हि इज प्लेइंग से खेलते से इ वज प्लेइंग से खेलते इल वि प्लेइंग से खेलते थक सो परफेक्ट कंटिन्यूस टेंस लुक एट the bengali sentences are the same i have already told you that and um, now i have also and uh, now i have uh, going to show you the ex time expression here i have um, marked here with green color since for okay these are time expression so after since or for we added some time and in the case of present in the case of present continuous past continuous future continuous there you will get um, there we will get no time expression so jokhon amra time expression pabo tokhon amra for this step ta amra byabohar korbo eta ki amra advanced level tense bolchi advanced tense bolchi suppose eki shomoye dui ta kaj past hoye chilo eki shomoye otite dui ta kaj hoye chilo so how we will write this two sentences okay so when we will get he had paid before my father came suppose 
he had played before my father can she amar baba ashar purbe kire chilo so two action happen at the um, in the, at the past time okay and we are writing this one the, the earlier past we are writing in past perfect and uh, very close past tense we are writing past indefinite okay so this way we have to explain we have to explain this and uh, we, we remember this structure and uh, i think this structure will help you to understand to our next topic okay let's go to our next topic next follow me here i have explained the three type of tenses okay at first i have explained present tense and past tense present tense are four types and uh, past tense are also four types here i have placed an example place some examples of present four type of tenses and uh, i have a, also present here the sentence structure okay how the tenses are formed look at present tense present indefinite he plays tennis or he plays or he plays okay structure look at subject he, i play verb 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 number one or base form and uh, when we get the he plays when we get the singular singular person singular third person we usually add s or es at the end of verb these are the uh, structure that i have shown here subject verb number one of base form infinitive form plus extension okay extension what is action extension he plays tennis tennis here is extension or object okay sometimes extension will be sub object sometimes will be adverb sometimes will be complement adjective okay different types we will get different type of extension i am playing tennis continuous tense structure after subject subject here i i am b verb m is are these are b verb and then we are using base form with ing form okay look at playing play plus ing form playing i am playing tennis this is the continuous present continuous structure i have played tennis here i subject have or has these are helping verb because we are getting another verb tennis sorry and then another verb played played is here main verb and have is here helping verb helping verb of uh, perfect tense have is helping verb of perfect tense so subject have or has we have to address it we have to take and then we have to use the verb number three i have played tennis and tennis here extension or object here and next i have been playing tennis for two hours i have been playing and i am playing bangla sentence bangla sentences are same bangla meaning are same ami khelte si ami khelte si tennis for two hours dui ghonta dhore dui ghonta byapia okay so when we are getting time expression we are using the perfect structure clear present perfect structure and when you are getting no time expression when you will not get any time expression you have to use the simple continuous i am playing and i am playing for two hours these are the difference between present continuous and perfect continuous okay sometimes we have to use since suppose i have been playing since morning since money shakal since money থেকে সিন্স অর ফ্রম একই মানে সিন্স অথবা ফ্রম আমরা ব্যবহার করতে পারি সিন্স অথবা ফ্রম যার অর্থ হচ্ছে থেকে বা হতে ফর শব্দের অর্থ হচ্ছে ধরিয়া ব্যাপিয়া যাব এটা আমরা বলে থাকি সো ইজ আর দ্য সেন্টেন্সেস অ্যান্ড এক্সাম্পল অফ সেন্টেন্সেস অ্যান্ড ইজ আর দ্য স্ট্রাকচার অফ দিস সেন্টেন্সেস অফ দিস টেন্সেস ওকে পাস টেন্স past indefinite past continuous past perfect past perfect continuous past indefinite i play tennis as subject plus verb number 2 that means past form play 
create this as past form and then we have to use the extension tennis is here object or extension i was playing tennis here was is b verb structure subject i b verb is was where i have used here was with i okay i have i was b verb is agreed with i playing as these are continuous tense we are using ing form একটা কথা আবার মনে রাখতে বলছি তোমাদের যখনই আমরা কন্টিনিউস টেন্স পাবো হোয়েন উইল গেট দ্য টেন্স অফ কন্টিনিউস কন্টিনিউস স্ট্রাকচার উই হ্যাভ টু ইউজ বি ভার ওকে অ্যান্ড দেন উই হ্যাভ টু ইউজ আইএনজি ফর্ম ওকে প্লেইং প্লেইং দিস আর কন্টিনিউস টেন্স হেয়ার অফ কন্টিনিউস পাস্ট কন্টিনিউস প্লেইং অ্যান্ড পাস্ট পারফেক্ট কন্টিনিউস ওকে প্লেইং সো ইন দ্য কেস অফ কন্টিনিউস টেন্স আমাদের মনে রাখতে হবে সবসময় আমরা আইএনজি ফর্ম ব্যবহার করব এবং কন্টিনিউস টেন্সে সবসময় আমরা বি ভার ব্যবহার করব দিস আর দ্য ডিফেন্স এমং আদার টেন্স ওকে অ্যান্ড এমং আদার টেন্স অ্যান্ড এম কন্টিনিউস টেন্স কন্টিনিউস এবং অন্য টেন্সের ক্ষেত্রে একই আমরা এই পার্থক্যটা আমরা দেখে দেখতে পাব অ্যান্ড হ্যার অলসো পাস্ট কন্টিনিউস টেন্স দ্যার ইজ নো টাইম এক্সপ্রেশন হোয়েন উই আর ইউজিং পাস্ট পারফেক্ট হোয়েন উই আর রাইটিং past perfect continuous tense we are using time expression yes, for 2 hours for 7 days okay or since morning since sorry since uh, they have been playing uh, since monday last okay this is why we have to form tenses okay dear students on this current slide i am going to explain the future tense Future tense have four types, we know, future indefinite, future continuous, future perfect, future perfect continuous. On the right side, I have shown the tense structure of future tense here. I shall play tennis, future indefinite, structure shall, sorry, I, subject, shall helping verb shall or will we have to agree with the subject and verb one there is base form of verb or infinitive form tennis here extension so in all in every cases we have to use shall or will and shall and will these two verbs are future tense marker amader mone rakhte hobe sob khetre amra shall othoba will byabohar kore থাকি এখানে শেল এবং উইলকে আমরা সব সময় ফিউচার টেন্সের ফিউচার টেন্স মার্কার হিসাবে আখ্যায়িত করে থাকি অ্যান্ড নেক্সট লুকেট আই শ্যাল বি প্লেইং টেনিস ফিউচার কন্টিনিউস টেন্স দেয়ার ইজ নো টাইম এক্সপ্রেশন অ্যান্ড আই শ্যাল হ্যাভ বিন প্লেইং টেনিস ফর টু আওয়ার্স দেয়ার ইজ টাইম এক্সপ্রেশন টাইম এক্সপ্রেশন সো হোয়েন উইল গেট টাইম এক্সপ্রেশন উই হ্যাভ টু ইউজ ফিউচার পারফেক্ট কন্টিনিউস টেন্স and uh, when we will get no time expression we have to use the simple future continuous tense okay this is what we have to use and these are structures subject shall we be verb number one or base form with ing form okay and i have already told you that when we will get continuous tense jokhon amra continuous tense pabo tokhon amra ing form byabohar kore thaki ekhane continuous tense ekhane continuous tense amra ing form byabohar korechi ebong jokhon amra continuous tense byabohar korechi tokhon arekta bar seta hocche be verb e be verb or is help us to form continuous tense okay so jokhon amra continuous pabo tokhon amra be verb byabohar korbo আর যখন আমরা ফিউচার টেন্স হয় উইল ফর্ম ফিউচার টেন্স ইন এভরি টেন্সেস উইথ এভরি টেন্সেস উইল ইউজ শেল আর উইল অ্যান্ড অ্যাকর্ডিং টু ট্র্যাডিশনাল গ্রামার উই ইউজ শেল উইথ ফার্স্ট পার্সন আই অর উই উইথ আই অর উইথ উই ইউজ শেল মডেল ভার্ক অ্যান্ড রিমেনিং উইথ রিমেনিং রিমেনিং tenses we use will form okay will that is first person khetre shall ebong second person ebong third person khetre amra will behavior kore thaki and these are the future tense marker so according to modern grammar especially the people of america they always use will form with every person okay singular or plural or third person in every case they will use will 
will verb and in people of England they use shall with first person and with second and third person they use will okay and you look at future perfect tense I shall have played tennis before father comes before my father comes okay so when we get to action when we get to action we can have a heart when we get to action 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 Former action we write in we write in future perfect structure and is later verb or later action we will write in present indefinite or simple present tense structure okay I am going to ask you to ask you to ask you past tense is the same as the past indefinite even past indefinite even future future sorry past indefinite and past perfect tense this is the part of the key you can show for a past indefinite manus in the growth it past part it was to do with the one do it action a quiz on the good way data are the good with the earlier past we write in past perfect the later past we write in past indefinite in the same way in the case of few settings we can say same thing I'm ready to finish it will attack the body and here we can see the sentence tense structures and we have to study again and again we have to remember memorize this and we have to remember this okay here I have shown that I have shown the time marker and how to use the time expression okay look at when we get two actions actions means bar joke number do it a cause a key shonge pavo we use before after okay we had example we had played cricket before his father came okay there are two action had played and came okay the before when is before the before bar we have to write in past perfect and the later verb we have to write in past or simple past tense okay so we have to remember that when two action happen in the past time the earlier past we have to write in past perfect and later past later past we have to write in past independent or simple past ekhane jokhon dui ta action odite ghotbe je action ta ghot dui ta action odite ghotechilo je kaj ti age ghotechilo seta ke amra dur otit boli eta ke amra english te past perfect bolbo jeta pore ghote seta ke amra past indefinite othoba nikur otit bolbo okay second example the patient died after the doctor had came okay we use here past perfect after after means पहले इर पहले अमरा पास्ट पार्फेक्ट करेंगे एंड बिफोर मींस आगे अमरा आगे पास्ट पार्फेक्ट करेंगे दिस वो यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर सो आफ्टर वी हैव यूज़ पास्ट पार्फेक्ट एंड आफ्टर ए हर यूज़ सिंपल पास्ट द पेशेंट डाइट सिंपल पास्ट और पास्ट इज इतने तो फिर एंड टाइम इस वन सिंस फ्रॉम सिंस फ्रॉम म since after since or from uh, we use time expression and since from means starting time they express the starting time they tell us the point in time okay the example it has been raining since morning starting time here we are getting the starting time since morning means from morning from morning it has been raining okay so since or from tell us the tell us about the starting time or tell us about the point in time for for indicates total time or duration or period of time data camera banglai dhore bapia jabot bore thaki it has been raining for three days तीन दिन जाबोत बिस्ती होते हैं, बाबरिस्ती पोड़ते से, अथवा तीन दिन धुरे बिस्ती होते हैं, अथवा 
तीन दिन व्यापिया बेसि पड़ते से सो फर इंडिकेट द टोटल टाइम एंड सेंस फ्रम इंडिकेट द स्टार्टिंग टाइम दिस वाई यू हाव टू रिमेम्बर क्लियर वी आर गोयिंग टू आवर नेक्स्ट स्लैड डे स्टूडेंट्स आई डोट लाइक टू एनलार्ज माई टूडेज लेक्चार अलरेडी आई हाव टक थार्टी फाइव मिनिट्स एंड दैट इज वाई आई एम गोयिंग टू फिनीश आर टूडेज लेक्चार If you face any problem, you can comments on the comments box, and I will try to give the answer of your problem. Okay, so no more today. Thank you. Best of luck. Allah Hafiz.